Hello friends, hello, hello. I am jumping on to do a really fun craft, Christmas craft kit I have. And I'm using this amazing vintage toilet paper. I have several of these on the website if you're interested and if you're not, that's cool too. I'm good either way, but that's what I'm working on and I wanted to share about it. I wanted to talk about what I shared yesterday. All the deeds. I don't even know if I'm going to have anybody join me, but if I do, great. If I don't, catch the replay, let me know about it, okay? And I have been painting some little buntings. I have these in a kit on the website. It's super cute. I'm going to show you what I'm going to do. I have did this before, but I'm going to switch it up. And... Anyway, so if you join, say hello. I appreciate all the hearts and the likes, and even in the replay, it would be fabulous. I appreciate it so much. So I'm just gonna dry these, and then share a little bit about yesterday. So I got on there, I got on here, for anybody on YouTube, I kinda had to go to pieces, and I shared that with y'all. Because I'm, pretty op I'm a pretty open book. Um, I just, um, I'm just going to be honest with you. It's been a little crazy. The lean with the business, not for anybody to feel sorry for me. Hey, um, so if you're on, just say hi, because unless you say hi, I don't know you're with me, but anyway, or just give me some hearts. You don't have to say hi. You just give me some hearts. Anyway, I'm just, I found, found my heat tool to heat my quiet one, Lee. Um, and I kind of just lost it yesterday. Hello, hello, hello. And I just was brutally honest with you all. I still don't know, I'm not closing my shop immediately. Um, I alluded to liquidating everything. I'm not gonna do that just yet. So I'm sorry about that. I'm just, I just decided to take a beat because I kind of panicked yesterday and I'm just gonna see where God leads me. So I'm just gonna get on here and I, I promise y'all I'd go live every day in November and at least the weekdays, maybe the weekends, I don't know. But I'm going to do a fun craft every day of something in my shop. And if you wanna order the kit, great. If you don't, great, no big deal. I'm gonna be using Sorry Silk with this. I'm gonna be using some of my stamps, the um, typesetting. I'm going to be using um, a vintage linen paint. And so let's dive in. I'll show you what I'm working on. So these are just wooden bunting tags. I have these. This will come with a kit if you're interested. And you can, I'm doing four. The kit comes with Noel, but you can do, um, hello, hello, thank you all so much. You can do um, whatever you'd like. It's a really quick, I think I have, yep, I need a piece of sandpaper. Um, we're just going to glue on this really fun fall paper. It is vintage wrapping paper that I have. And I've had it for years and years, and 25 years at least. And so we're just going to, I'm just going to cut this up. This will come. What do you get in the kit is you will get four of these. You will get four discs of the big red and four disc of the white. I'm gonna show you what we're gonna do with that. Hey Dee! And then if you want to add Sorry Silk, I have that for sale. I mean, you can use any color. Um, I have a bunch on the website. If you get my kit, you can use some from your kit. Um, or you can use string, whatever you'd like to do. String will come with the kit, and if you wanna do that, you can use the string. It comes with just um, a, so I think it comes with string, I don't know. I'm pretty sure it comes with string, yes. So if that's what you want, you can do that. Or you can do yarn, whatever your little heart desires. I'm just kidding. And then you'll have extra, a bit of extra that you can use on anything. And the reason I went ahead and painted it white, because I didn't in the old before, and I feel like that was a mistake, so. Right there's the link if y'all are interested. Can we straighten this up? There we go. Let's just paper towel underneath it because it was there and it was easy. And you can totally use um, crystal clear chandelier. I just um, I just wanted to grab something fast and easy. And so any kind of Mod Podge or you can use your crystal clear chandelier. You can use um, whatever you'd like 
on this and then you just kind of lay it down and press it on there. Try to get it straight if you can. There we go. I'm not all about straight, but there you go. And so we're just gonna press that on there really well and let it dry and then we'll trim it off. And I'm gonna do a little twist with it. I'll show you what I'm gonna do. You don't have to have, you don't have to have the stamps to do that. You can do your own handwriting. If you got somebody that does that awesome, you know, writing that's so amazing, get a friend to do that for you. You know? Is that straight? That looks kind of straight, doesn't it? Is that straight? I think it works. Maybe my paper is crooked. Oh well, I don't think anybody's gonna tell. Hey Kate! Um She's worn out, y'all, because she's been working on a haunted house for weeks. So, scaring people, but they had a, it was successful. So, anyway, I am, so that's where I kind of am. I'm just decided, I'm just going to get back to doing the crafts that I love and creating with you all. And that's where, that, that's not straight. That is clearly not straight. Let's do like that. And you can do the back. You all can paint the back if you want to. I don't do that. And probably the edges may are gonna need a little re -zhuzhin. I'm okay with that. Um, and I'm just using a big glue stick. You can use any kind of glue you want. Honestly, it's, yeah, don't put it on upside down. <gasps> hey, oh, awesome. Great. We got a troll from YouTube. Thank ya. Okay. <sighs> okay, here we go. So, I'm just going to go right here. I'm going to trim this off and then we're going to get it to fit snug on there. Haley, I think you can get on um, YouTube if you want to. That'd be great. That's fun and exciting. I'm such a little piddly thing on YouTube. Yeah. Hey, Danielle. So I just am getting these glued down. So we're just gonna let these kind of sit here all snug. I can go in and add some glue too. I'm just gonna trim them off and then we can go in with some um, three and one if we need to closer. And I'm gonna show what we're gonna do with the, um, I got a couple of ideas to use the glitter. You don't have to do this. The glitter does not come with the kit nor does the sorry silk or the stamps, that you all can write it, or you can get stamps, it's whatever you'd like. You don't have to do it, I just do, I just have it. And, look how easy that is. We'll see if that's straight. It might be straight, it might not be, I don't know. Now I keep these scraps, because these would be great for journals, but if you're not into journals, don't keep them. Yeah. So, guys, I appreciate any um, love you want to give or any sprinkling you want to give. It just lets both platforms know, oh, my gosh, she does cute stuff. You know, when you comment, it just makes people, you know, see ya. I'll just have to delete that one after we're done. And so any questions about yesterday, my rant. So I'm just going to be honest with y'all and just, you know, share my struggles because that's, I can't do it any other way. That's just who I am. Y'all know that. You know, I just tell you everything. So <clears throat> anyway, I am going to, um, we're going to let these dry for a second. And show you what we're going to do with these. Super cute. So, what we end up doing, I think we have four red discs, just red cardstock, super cute, and then white cardstocks. 
these are three inches and I think this is like two. And I'll show you how we're gonna glue it together. But first, we're gonna do something super cute and you're gonna be like, what is she talking about? What is she doing? Oh, no. Do y'all like my funky glasses? They're new, you can kind of see them. They have like a, they have like a thing on for the screen. Mm -hmm. Okay, I gotta go get my little glue, gluing glue thing, because we're gonna do some glitter. So I'm gonna let, I'm gonna let you just gander at this, think about this, and figure out where am I gonna put the glitter on here. Two seconds, well, more like five. Somebody count for me. See how long it takes me. like 20 I think <laughs> it's like who remembers who's who has seen Bridget Jones's diary oh hey hey Katie who remembers who remembers the movie Bridget Jones's diary and how she comes back for... <sighs> no it's not it's the second one the second one I'm gonna I'm gonna dive you in so um, the second Bridget Jones, where she gets arrested, and then she doesn't know that Mark rescues her and says all that stuff. Anyway, she's all, she's got like a dress, she has like a jacket on, and she tells the cabbie, I'm literally going to be two seconds and like 45 minutes later. I'll dive down. Let's dive down. Let's get down into it. There we go. Okay. Aren't they super cute? I promise we're going to fix it. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to do Noel just because I like it and it's easy and I don't have to repeat anything with it. I'm just taking my typesetter. I'm going to have to use this. So we're going to need an O, obviously, an E, L, and an N. I'm using lowercase because I want to fit on there. Okay, then. And I, and so I'm going to use, okay, hold, I'm going to use yellow for the letters. Yellow, you say, why would you use yellow, Beth? I just am, because I want to. Let me show you what I'm going to do with yellow, okay? Oh, that's what I can do. I can just use the lid. That's way easier than the whole, you know, big sheet because I forgot to bring something. Okay, in. There we go. Boom. This is not how you should do it, but this is how I'm doing it, okay? This is on the fly. And I have to rock it. Don't I have to rock a little bit because this is a little bit of a. You can you can't see it correctly, but we don't need to see it perfectly. I'll tell you why. Just a little bit. Okay. Because we will see it. Anybody have an idea what I'm gonna do? Anybody got it? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, and oh, shoes, sugar foot. Okay, there we go. Okay, who's got an idea what we're doing? Anybody? This is like it's you know, this is not. This is when you aren't prepared, as in most of my days. Okay, so I'm gonna dry this ink real fast. Dry it, dry it, dry it, dry it. With my little heat tool. We don't need this red. It's fine, we just need these. Woohoo! Okay. So, this is what we're going to do. 
I've never done this, but I think this is gonna be fun. We're gonna glitter them up. Yes, and I love this one. I had to go get this because it has that tiny little, um, you know, tip that I can't actually write with. And why I'm using the yellow because we're using the gold glitter and I just thought it would be a better background. See what I'm saying? Y'all, oh, there it comes. I was like, why are you fighting me, Mr. Glue? Okay, so tell me, I know this is early for Christmas, guys, but I'm setting up my shop for Christmas. I'm reopening on Saturday, and it will be all set for Christmas. I just, I was trying to do it in two days, and it just wasn't going to happen, because, you know, the elves just don't show up for me like I ask them to all the time. Anyway, so I'm going to be putting together lots of kits, lots of fun things. They'll be on the website. That's what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be sharing. Um, I'm having some classes coming up. Okay, so then we're just going to take our gold. That's a lot of glitter. <gasps> Look how cute that is. Now, if you don't have to have this art glitter glue, you don't have to have that. You don't. Seriously, you don't have to have that. But it makes it, you just need something with a tip. And you can get these anywhere, okay? So, you can buy them on, they have a little tip on Amazon. Okay? So, don't, don't assume you have to have this and you could just you could get Elmer's and just water it down a bit if you wanted to probably to get a little more flowy because it needs to be able to flow a little bit like so that it um, will flood it's almost like you're flooding a cookie like when Lauren floods her cookies yeah so that's, um, that's kind of exciting. But I'm not flooding a cookie. I'm flooding a, I'm flooding for glitter. So that if it doesn't get, I feel like, and I'm just using a spoon because I can dump it on there. Easy, you can always get like a, I get these bowls, you know, from the Dollar Tree, because you get a dozen for $1.25, and they're easy to reuse. <gasps> There's the E, oh. So all this is available on the website, the glitter, not the glue. I do have this glue that you can totally use. I just don't have a fine tip for it, but you can put it in a fine tip. Um, honestly, Elmer's is probably just as good, guys. And if you want to, um, you can totally do that. Okay, any questions? Let's chat. Thank you all to those of you that responded to the classes on my Facebook page. I'm so grateful because here's the thing. I'm going to do a class in-house and maybe online. I don't know. I can give you a supply class, a supply list of the tree, that really fun tree that um, um, I put on there. It won. That number, it was option one, and it got the most votes, so that was fun. Are we still here? Because nobody's talking to me. Am I still? Am I still? Am I still rolling? Am I still broadcasting? Is that the word? Am I still going out into the nether regions of the world? Oh, oops, oops. I squished it. Let's add a little more glitter. Okay, it doesn't have to be perfect. I do not care for perfection. Okay, what do I say about perfection is for pansies? I gotta get that on a t-shirt. I'm working on that too. So, yes. So if you want these kits, 
Let me know. They're so cute. I think, I don't even know what I have on them. What do we have on them, Lee? I think, I, th I, th I, th I don't think they're, um, okay, thank you, Danielle. Thank you, thank you. I'm having a massive hot flash. Whew. All of a sudden, I'm getting stressed about something. So everybody's wearing these big giant glasses, you know. Okay, I, and so here's the funny thing. My husband goes, those are big glasses. And I said, yes, they are. They're, they're trendy right now, babe. And, he, and then I have on my belt, I have on my big wide-legged pants because I love them. And, and I, he goes, those are big pants. And I'm like, yep, yep, they are. And um, he's just, he just keeps commenting on all that stuff. So I find it very interesting. Love is heart. What do I mean? What do I mean? What's the price of the of this kit on my website? I couldn't remember what we what we what we said it was, and I don't know what. Oh, oh, hot flush. Yeah, I do too, Judy. I do too. Okay. Okay. There we go. We're not done with the glitter either, but right now we're going to. So we're gonna let those dry. And they're gonna be awesome. So this you have to keep this. I used to watch each they they have big like all the junk journalers. Oh thank you, Shannon. Thank you. I like them too, and I have them in different colors. I got them on Amazon, y'all. I think they were like you, you got they were 12 or 15 bucks for three. So they're really, really, really highbrow and expensive. All right, anyway. Um, I am oh, gotta move this. We're gonna let those dry a bit. I'm gonna show you what we're gonna do. And I should have done this because this is gonna be really annoying. But you can take, it's gonna just sound awful to y'all, so I don't want to do it. But I'm gonna do just a little bit. You can take your, um, and you can sand the edges, but it's gonna be like biting on aluminum foil if I do this with y'all listening. So I'm just gonna show you, the only place I'm gonna do it is on the peak because isn't that awful if you don't like chalkboards sorry but it kind of it, it just will peel right off so it gives you a really a much easier edge like that it just doesn't sound great Ten dollars. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, honey. Lee, what else was I supposed to talk about? You sent me a text and I forgot to write it down. Oh, the yes, the number one. Yes, I did remember. Okay. So then you just do this, and I'm just gonna do this real fast. I just want to do the edges. Now let's see if this is gluey. Let's put a little of this glue right here because this sticks to everything. And it dries really fast, which I love. That um, three in one. It just doesn't give you a smooth finish, you know? So I'm not gonna do everything. I will finish it and show you what it looks like, but you can finish it however you want to. You don't have to do this. This is just, this is a suggestion. This is not a requirement. Nobody has to do this. Okay, how I'm going to do it. All right, then. <clears throat> These are pokey little things from the Dollar Tree that I love. You're just going to poke a hole in it. Like that. Just pokey little holes. And it just pokes that hole. There we go. In this paper, fun... I have sold it. I'm now I, I was selling it by the yard, but I had to stop because I was almost out. So now I'm just using it for crafts and kits. But I've had this for so long, and you can't because it's matte. You can't find it anywhere. Is this okay? That needs a little glue. Okay. Yeah, I think so too. It's just a fun little kit, and 
for y'all to have fun with and create. Okay, so this is what I want to do with the glitter. I just want to enjoy this gold and deliciousness. So I'm just going to run it around the bottom of this. I'm going to take this glitter, this glue. It actually comes with the from the company I buy the glitter with. So anyway, but I thought it would be fun just to put a little shimmer on this edge. And here's the thing, guys, you can do this. You know, you can, you, you don't have to do it just for, if you wanna just use a piece of tape, you can, um, you can just glue and tape it on there and you can make, put love. And to keep their eyes out for your lookbook and milk. Oh yes, okay, that's right, that's right. I am coming up with a really fun lookbook this week and it's gonna have links to all my favorites in the shop and for sale. It's gonna be really cute and what you got ideas. And then, um, looky there, how cute is that? So then you just take your, you just take your circle Okay, and a lookbook, and I'm going to put together, because I have the Sweet Pickens Milk Paint, and I've just never done anything with it. I never even got it on my website, because I'm just that way, and it's, I don't have the bandwidth. I'm going to sell them in um, groups, so they are $16.50 each, and I'm going to sell them, which that would be like $18, it would be $18, $19, almost $20, yet yeah, the lookbook will have all the goodies in it. Thank you. So I'm gonna to put together three colors, and it's gonna be sold by colors like pinks, greens, blues, hey Kathy, um, blacks, you know, um, turquoise, that kind of thing. And it's gonna be in a box, you get three colors, that's all you're gonna get with it, and it's gonna be 15 bucks, so you get a really good, you get them at a great price. And they will be up this week, as soon as I can get them on the website. Yes. Sorry, so you don't get to pick your colors, but I will put them like light. There's gonna be like purples, pinks, reds, blues, greens, whites, grays, blacks, that kind of thing, in color families. Okay, so then we just stick that right there. And then we're gonna take the Noel, the little end right here. And you can, you can put it on there any way you want to. And Glue it down, and then you're gonna let it dry. This would be so cute on a mantle. You could layer this up. You could put it on the front of your tree. You could do so much. You could do red glitter. You could do pink glitter. You could do any color glitter you want. And then let's say, and then if you want to have some sorry silk to hang it with, you can just go in and you can, and I have, I do have red sorry silk, I think. I just got some, but I don't know if it's on the website. It's part of my Sorry Silk subscription box. If you want that, it would be great. You don't even really need a yard for this. And so then you just layer it in there. And look how cute. Even that higgity piggity stuff is cute. Isn't that cute? I feel like that is really stinking cute. I do, I do, I do. Isn't that fun? So there you go. Let me hold it up for you. See if you can see it. Maybe it's better light that way. And isn't that just the wrong way? And that's crooked. Isn't that pretty? And so it just drapes. And then you could you could always go in and paint the edges if you want to. Whatever. I think that's fun. I think it's a really fun little project to do. Okay. So, let me talk about another one. I want to talk about what I'm doing. I'm doing the police tree. Remember I showed you all my joy, my little buntings that I made? Um, this one right here. And then these I'm going to make and sell. Just Oh, also, remember we did this with my... This is the same bunting piece that we did on this board. Oh, sorry. Okay. Okay, okay, I'm getting it, I'm getting it, I'm getting it. It'll be on today. Isn't that cute? So this is the same thing. You could make a bunch of different ornaments with these if you want to. So I will, I'll have a, the kits and then I will sell these 
in groups of six if you want them. So just let me know. Just send me a message. This is fun. So this one, I hate to do how cover that up, but this is going to go like this. Maybe this side. I'm going to glue that down, and then I'm going to put this on there. And I have a bunch of these to make. Where are those? They're really fun. And I think I'm going to do like a band of gold rather than just the edges. I mean, I like that pretty good. And then you put the joy over top, or I'm going to put Noel, or I don't know, I'm going to do something. But isn't that cute? And these will be for sale on my website. I may do them with pink. I don't know. Anyway, but this is a really cute thing I did. I want to show you real fast. So I'm putting the, I have a picture of the tree when I get it all done. I'm putting pink ribbon bows because it's a Parisian I just want to, I'll just show you a real quick little thing I'm doing. I need the fabric scissors. I'm doing a really cute pink Parisian tree. French Paris is what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing. Like I know anything, but like I've ever been to France. But anyway, I'm going, I'm doing fishtail. I'm doing bows, bows. This is just something you can do. So if you want to think about it, do. I'm gonna use this one. It's a double face satin ribbon. And um, I didn't have this out, but you just put a little bead right like that on it. Can y'all see what I'm doing? Okay. And so each tail, I just fishtail, eat the bow has, you know, I'm having them long drapey. I'll have a picture, I'll post a picture. It's super cute. And then I'm just glittering the edge of the ribbon with glitter. And isn't that cute? Oh, love it. Love it. This would be cute on any color ribbon. You could do the silver, you could do the blue, you could do it anyway. So that's it. I'll probably put that on a little on a little journal. Hey guys, I'm also I have a journal, um, a, a creative journal class. It's on the 15th. Um, Nope, it's the 13th. Oh. It's the Sunday, not this Sunday, but the next Sunday. And it's going to be live, and it's going to be in it's going to be online and in person. Or no, it's just going to be online. It's just solely online, and we're going to make journal inserts together. So if you're interested in that, go grab a spot. I think it's twenty five dollars. If there's a kit that comes with it that I will send out and through this Sunday. And then, or you can do it yourself. I'll give you a list of what you need, but we're going to make inserts. We're going to make them together, and we're going to, I'm going to show how I, how I love to create with it. So, you know, like why, how I would use this, which I think is going to be so cute in a book, in a journal. So, that's kind of my life, you know, it's paper. All right, what was I going to show you? One more thing. What was I going to show you? Does anybody remember what I was going to do? Or was that it? Okay, maybe that's it. All right, so you're just going to, let's look back down at this. These are available, look how cute. And so you can only imagine, good song, how cute these will be lined up across my mantle. Oh, so excited. Oh. Yes, cute stuff. And I've got some really cute, do y'all want to see a sneak peek of the Sorry Box? 27 for the course. Okay, Sunday 13th, 2 p.m. Thank you, Lee. And so that'll be a private group on Facebook, all right? So be watching. I've got several courses coming up. This is my first one. It's a fun little easy breezy one. And um, I'm, going to, I'm going to show you all my tips and tricks for journaling, all my favorite because I spend hours looking at ideas and watching people and putting it together. So, if, you were, if you're interested, please let me know. Go grab that and it'll be available. Okay, sneak peek on the Sorry Silk box this month. Okay, I haven't got everything tied up and done, but, okay, little bit of a peek. Isn't that glorious? It's not all Christmas greens. Look at this one. Oh, 
I'm loving it, loving it, loving it. This one is fun, it's brights, and this one is really fun. <gasps> Look at that. So there's all different kinds in there. This is a, oh, this is a really pale, pale, pale green. It's gorgeous. Pale, pale green, mint, like a mint chip of royal blue. Hang on. Rouge. Brown and turquoise, which it is, this turquoise is gorgeous and this brown is too, so beautiful. And what is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so this one is kind of a purpley blue. And then this one is a stripe. It's showing up a little more purple than it actually is in life. So, yeah. There you go, guys. I just showed you the whole box. And the extra special trim that you will get, because you get 10 of these, and then you get a surprise element that of my choosing. And this one is one that I am going to make for you. I have some silk, and I'm going to dye a custom color. Yes. Oh. And this is something, I bought some cotton velvet. And this is something I'm working on too. I, this was my very first, it kind of got janky, but isn't that pretty? I think this is aviary, so I'm gonna do Monet's garden. But I will be doing this, you will get this as well. So you get a yard of everything, and you never know what I might stick in, but you will for sure get 10 yards, one yard, <laughs> I always do that, one yard of 10 different sari silks, and then a special surprise element for your box. And those will be going out before the 12th. And you can go grab them right now if you want to. And they are going to be. And so um, we are going to combine the Zoom for November and October. We're gonna do that um, probably after the 15th. And I'll also go live in the group because I love to go on and show how I make stuff. And um, anyway, and I've also got, a, I've got several big announcements, so please stay tuned and be following me. If you get my emails, great. If you don't, please get them. I'm actually gonna start using them. If you want to get my text thread, here it is. I had 89, I lost somebody. I don't know who I lost. I, they're fine to me, I love them. It may, have, Steph, it may have been Stephanie because she was on there twice, my dear friend Stephanie. 859-587-6551. That is how you get the latest news. It's quick, it's actual text comes straight to me, so you can actually talk and text me back and forth and we can chat it up, get any questions. Um, and everything you need is on the website. And let's see, which is right here. Or if you don't want it, that's fine. I can just bring you ideas and go forth and create. It's totally okay with me. So, um, I think that's it. So be watching for the tree class the um, journal insert class, and the sorry silk. If you're not getting it, grab it. It's so fun, and you can you can do so much. Here, let me show you one little tr cool trick with the sorry silk. Can I show you that? I think I have. Okay, so this was in the last box. This peach because it was orangey. Yes, you can go to the website and get the emails. That'd be great. So okay, you have this. And you think, oh, this is all I have, but you can go in and you can do this and you can split it. And I just did this on a bunch of ornaments and they, this is how I tied up my ornaments. How fun is that? So you don't get just that. And the box for the um, Sweet Pickets Milk Paint, yes. So it's when, when you say you get a yard, you're really getting like three yards, okay? And you could easily glue these together or tie these together if you wanted to make something longer, if you got them, or you can use the little bits. They are just, you know, this is just, this is so much fun than just string. So guys, if you're interested, this is a beautiful thing to get. Like I use this, yeah, right here. Look how fun that is. Yep. And I just knotted it on the back. Yeah, and you just did vintage pages with it, with my, um, Glitter. My, my, I think it's my rose and gold. Is that what it is? 
Oh, yep, rose and gold. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Let me get it really close for you. Isn't that pretty? So, yeah. Okay, that's everything. Thanks so much. Appreciate it. Um, love for you to share. If you have any friends you think would be interested, please share me with them. That would be great. I have 1,078 last I looked on my page. I sent out a bunch of invites because apparently there are a lot of people who didn't like my page or follow my page. And somehow, like when I go, if, if I send an invite for something, it was wrong. But I'm just trying to build my page, regrow everything, you know. I have dog hair everywhere. This little girl right here. She's a hot mess. Her hair actually was with me when I had breakfast with a friend this morning. Literally. Can you believe that? Yeah. It was on the table. I brought it with me. All right. Y'all go have a great day. I'm going to get back to my Christmas decorating. Yep. All right. Thanks for putting up with me, and I just, more than anything, I covet your prayers. I just want to be forever in God's will. So, just pray for me, and um, there you go. I'm going to, I have a lot of, I have a lot of things that I may put into um, mystery boxes, like a Roy Cycle mystery box, the Sweet Pick and, the sweet pick and Milk Paint. These would be great gifts if you have a crafter, a creator in your life. I might do a glitter um, mystery box. I don't know. Um, I don't know. I've got all kinds of stuff, but anyway. Oh, yes, and I am on Pin Pinterest TV Friday at 6 p.m. There's a link for that, and um, let me show you what, I'm, let me show you what we're going to do. I'm going to show you how to make this. I'm a little nervous. I don't know how it's going to be. The camera-wise, I don't think I can use switcher but we're going to be making this journal something similar to this and this is from three let me show you so i made three envelopes i made them myself these right here and this and so out of paper and then i'm just going to show how to make a little journal on the inside and how to make pockets i have 30 minutes and i'm going to show look at that look at that what is that that's called sorry silk yeah and I'm going to show how to make that on Pinterest TV. So there you go. Thank you all so much. Thank you. I so appreciate your prayers. You really have no idea. So I'm just going to show how to make a cute little journal. I didn't even sew it in. I just tied it in. Yes. Pinterest TV. They're, they don't know what they've unleashed. <laughs> you know me. I'm a, bit of a, I'm a bit of a wild child. Okay. Let's get to creating, guys. Go out there and just do creativity. Make something beautiful. Let's love on people. And if you're in the area, come see me. I will be reopened for the rest of the month as is, as normal, starting this Saturday. I just couldn't get my shop together. But it's coming together, and I'm getting all my things together. So all my pretties, all my Christmas pretties, and it's fun. So 